Welcome back to Prime Time, y'all, and I'm back with another toxic topic. And before we get into this toxic topic, I'm gonna need you to go ahead and get your meal, your drink, your blunt, or your snack, and tell your man or your sneaky link that you will call them back, because Prime just dropped a new video. So, y'all, so this video gonna come out on the last day of Pride. And the toxic topic that I got for y'all today is the bussy. First, let me clarify, if you don't know what the bussy is, it's like boy pussy, a.k.a. the booty hole. So that, look, if you don't know what that is, you might need to click off the video, because, well, not, well, actually, not a lot of people know what bussy is. Okay, maybe not. You need to stay then if you don't know what it is. <laughs> you need to stay. So, y'all gotta remember, the booty hole is not a vagina, like... This goes to all, like, my tops, and you, like, it's not a, it's not a vagina, like, y'all just be getting up in that thing and just fucking shit up, like, it's like, come on now, y'all, I get it, you know, you can get real excited when you get up in it, or you've been waiting on it for a minute, like, they probably done had you wait for some weeks, some months, and then you finally there, you're like, yes. Or they ass probably fat. It's like, come on now. You just can't rush up in it. Like, especially if you got a big ass dick. Like, oh my God. You really can't be like, if your dick is like over, over eight inches, you really can't just be, mm -mm, you can't be doing that. Like, oh, and that's another thing. Like, just don't ask consent in the beginning. Like, you got to ask consent all the way through. Like, will you first, you know, get up in that thing? Is this okay? You know, is this is this good? Like, you like this? You Are you okay? You comfortable? You know? Next you know, when you start, you know, stroking it. You know what I'm saying? You you, you getting up in there. Is this okay? You know, you, you good? You, you feeling all right? Oh, oh, okay. You know, keep going. So, then when you start, you know, being that thing up, you... Is, is this okay? Is this good? You know, you know, ask consent. Then when you start doing trips, tricks and shit, like all of that, like you got to ask if this is okay. Are you comfortable? Like you just can't be going him. I feel like when you ask consent all the way through, it may show bottom more, you know, comfortable, more safe. Like, and plus it makes the experience more enjoyable because it's like, okay, like damn, like he care. Like he's showing like, Compassion and shit, you know, empathy for the booty hole, for the busty, you know what I'm saying? Show empathy for the busty, like, because you wouldn't want nobody just going up in your booty hole just, like, all hawking sumo wrestler and shit. Like, you wouldn't want somebody to, like, be patient with it, you know? Almost like, shit, for me, like, look, I'm going to need you to, like, put that motherfucker in, you know, one time, ooh, up, uh, take it out, it's not feeling right, then you go in for two. Mm, you know, you put the tip in, you know, to have the shaft in. Okay, mm, it's still not feeling right. Take it out again. Then on the third time, that's when you put it all the way in and you hold it there, see if they good. If they not good, take it out one more time or etc. But if they good, that's when you start doing what you need to do. I call that the, like, what what I call that? I call that the three strikes you out, bitch, because, like, if it's not good after three strikes, then it's just not going to happen. <laughs> Maybe even four. If you really feeling it, but if it's not, after three times, it's a cut. Be patient with, like, y'all just be beating it up. Like, y'all got to take in consideration that, like, all booty holes, all bussies is different. Like, some bussies need to be ate out. Some bussies need to be fingered. Some bussies need to be, I don't fucking know, prepared. Some bussies... Bitch need patience. You know, other bussies, you know, out there is like, I have met some sauce and did some bussies that have been like vaginas. You just go right on in. But like, that's the legendary few who can do that. But like, us normal, normal, average bussy holders can't just be doing all of that. You got to take your time. Like, you got to be patient with it. Like, oh, and nothing like, everything is not fucking lube. Okay? Everything is not lube. Like, 
dudes be having it fucked up like Vaseline, not lube. Spit, <laughs> spit, bitch. It's not motherfucking lube. Um, baby oil is not lube. Okay, lotion is not fucking lube. If it's not actually called fucking lube, bitch, it's not lube, period. If you don't got a bottle of Astral Glide or some KY, we not fucking, we not humping because you just not finna just throw that motherfucker in me with just raw, like, those four things are not lube. If it's not, hold on. If you don't got a bottle of this, can y'all see this shit? I don't think y'all can see, girl. Hold on. Can y'all see? I think y'all can see. If y'all don't got a bottle of Astro Glide or some KY, I prefer Astro Glide because, you know, water base, lube, or you could do silicone. I don't really like silicone because silicone is too. I feel like silicone too sticky. Like, I just, I don't like all of that. It's just, it's too sticky. So, I, you know, I like a good water base type lube. So, you know, in and out. And plus, it just. Even though water-based lube, it probably lasts for like a good 10 to 15 minutes. But like, let's be real. Like, most of these niggas not lasting that long anyway. <laughs> for real. So, go ahead and get your little water-based lube. It only costs like, what, $15, $10, depending on where you going and what bottle you get. So, go get you. Oh, shit. This is not sponsored by the. Oh, I wish. I need to. Oh, imagine. I'm going to get sponsored by Astro Glide. Ah, bitch. Because I'll be using y'all. Y'all need to sponsor me. But yeah, y'all. Just pretty much take your time with your bottom. Or your verse. You know what I'm saying? Because you just can't be doing that. Like, have, be considerate of the bussy. And remember, a bussy is not a pussy. Period. <laughs> oh, I need somebody to clip that for me. <laughs> Okay, but yeah, y'all, that's really all I wanted to talk about for the toxic topic, and I'm going to catch y'all next time on another prime time.